How's it going guys? Dark Carbon EX here and today I'm going to be unboxing the Charizard EX box. Uh, this is a fairly newer box as you can tell from the two packs of evolutions. So there's not much more to say about this box because it's fairly self-explanatory looking. So I'll just pop into it and see what we get. Let's see if I can open it with a knife. Can I? Oh, I could use a saw. It's a little sawing action. There we go. There we go. It's kind of kind of kinky. All right, pop this open. Get all the debris off and pop out all of what is contained in this box. Now let's get the glare inducing plastic off if I can find the edge. Uh, there we go. Carefully pop the promo card out. Come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. I, I believe in you. Oh, oh wow, that bent the hell out of the card. See, is it bent now? Oh, it's bent like that. Yeah. So obviously this card was not in the newer set of promos that don't typically have the issue of bending. But I do like how the cards, this card slides out the back. Is this, no, this one's bent too. But these cards really don't matter if they're bent or not. Which I like these big cards, I really do. Because I can make a really cool looking table out of them. Which is going to be a really fun project. Let's take this code, put it as in my non-giveaway code piles that I don't redeem, so I don't know why I don't give them away. Alright, so we have a Steam Siege, a Fates Collide, and two Evolutions. Let's just pop into these real quick. Let's put that back there. Get off my hand. Oh, that just popped open very interestingly. Yoink! Let's put this over here. Three to the front. A Wormadom. That oh, a double carless. Yes, I love these. Those are so useful. Raisin Snubble, Seal, Bronzor, Katoni, Burmy. Oh, look at that. That is amazing. OP Fates Collide pack right here. And the is the what is that? Oh, a hollow mew. Nice. Some nice looking hollow on that card. I need to move that light. That light's in, in the way. There we go. There we go. No, that the lighting's fixed. I'm gonna put that over there. I may or may not go over those. It's just a hollow mew. It's just a hollow mew. We all know what that code card means. If you don't, it, then I'll keep it a secret to spoil the surprise. There's a Klefki with the world's longest ability. Captivating Pokepuff, a Flaffy, a C Dot, a Sneasel, Oshawa, a Fletchling, a Larvista, Armaldo Reverse Hollow. That's a Reverse Hollow rare. Look at that thing. Hmm. And a Talon Flame. That is a good, that's actually a really good card. A lot of people run that card, especially with the Greninja deck. If that's the first card you can put on the field, you are set for the match. Oh, come on. Hey, here we go. Uh, evolutions, a Super Potion. A Brock's Grit, a Maintenance, a Onyx, a Star U, a Pikachu, Doduo, Ponyta, Reverse Hollow Porygon, that's an uncommon, and a Mewtwo Regular Rare. Neat. The final pack of Evolutions, which, oh, well, there's a Star U right there. And then there's a green code card. Yes, I love this card. 
two double colorless energy. That's a win right there because I don't get a lot of double colorless energy. I really don't and I really wish I got more of them because they are amazing. Oh, oh, a reverse holo rare Chansey. That's neat. And then a Eradicate. Eh. Okay, so no EXs besides the promo. That kind of sucks. That doesn't kind of suck. That really sucks. But we do know this card is a good card. It's not hollow or anything, but it is a Talon Flame. By the ability and the attack. So pretty much second turn or first turn, whichever one, however the coin flip goes, you can use that card to its fullest effect very effectively. Obviously double colorless, self-explanatory for how good they are. The Charizard EX promo with Stoke and Fire Blast. And then the big one. Which are, uh, the way it's designed is like, it looks like a dog trying to attack you. Like you just got home from work and you have a pet dog and it's like, oh my god, I can't believe it. And it's doing this whole dog thing and running at you and wanting to like hop on you and stuff. That's what it looks like he's going for. That's his emotion. And then the Hollow Mew, which is the only interesting thing that we got out of the packs besides the Talon Flame. So, fairly simple video, fairly not spectacular. But I promise there are better videos. So, if you want to see more of those videos, subscribe. And that'll be it for this video. Have a good day, guys. Oregon.